Did you all sleep in the clothes you're currently wearing? No, I didn't. Yes. change. Oh, well. <laughs> Fuck you too, then. <laughs> I had a shower, got dressed. You know what else I did? What? I rated you and liked you on Facebook and Twitter. Hey! Like you should. You can't work. rate us on Facebook and Twitter! <laughs> Welcome from the hat, the show we draw a topic out of the hat, just like it says in the title. I'm Ben. I'm Gabby. I'm Phoenix. <laughs> nice. Smooth. Tell me not to talk. I know, I did. <laughs> Phoenix. Yeah. What are we talking about today? Okay, today we are talking about the uh, the age old uh, thing of discussion. Um, from a hat. From, from a hat. Um, from a hat. <laughs> Star Wars. Yes! Star Wars it is. Hi guys, uh, this episode was recorded back in November, prior to the release of Rogue One, which is why we talk about it like it hasn't happened yet, because at the time of this recording, it hadn't come out, so we hadn't seen it. So yeah. Uh, anyway, enjoy! Okay, cool. Alright, so which Star Wars song is the opening thing? Phantom Menace, uh, the... the... <laughs> That was not even Countdown. That was Final Countdown. I actually was trying no, to do. That's you know, how Toad the... Death I am. Yeah, no, I'm just going to use the main theme. Coward! <laughs> <laughs> no, Darth Vader's theme would be good. I don't well. want to use Imperial March. That's good. Every time I'm I not try using to Final, Final Count! Of Star Wars. I like it. It's a piece them. of shit. Agreed. I'm joking. I actually like it. Fine. I you, don't, you, don't, you don't like them. You like number seven and that's it. I like anything after number seven. Um, I don't like the original trilogy. I don't like the prequels. I hate anything before. Why the... do you hate it? Do you hate it because it's like overrated? No, I hate it because it's dumb. Why is it dumb? Space everything, wizards. Everything. Space wizards. Dumb. I hate how it's space wizards and everyone's all like, oh no, it's not space wizards. It's space wizards. Well, if you want to get technical, it's space wizards, I guess. No, no, it's space wizards, full stop. Just space more, hippies. The entire problem can be solved <laughs> with the force. What do you mean? Okay, Darth Vader on yeah. the Death Star, right? Yes. You get Luke, get Obi Wan. Sure. Get him on the Death Star. Yeah. Force choke Darth Vader. What? Solve all your problems. Wouldn't what? solve all your problems. Chucks. You've killed Darth Vader. You've, you can't. Sh- you can't. You've done your end goal. Darth Vader. Why not? Because Darth Vader's machine. Power. You're right. He is. Then in that case, just fucking force throw a bloody pipe through his chest. Ba- 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 that ba- even force chokes is Darth Vader. And being a Jedi, like you don't have like it's stronger being a Sith than it is a Jedi. So no, agreed. So just become yeah, a Sith. It's... Use your lightning powers. Kill all the other Sith. Well. No. You can't be a Sith and then kill all of the Siths. Why not? Rule of two. That's the rule of two. two That's literally the point of Siths, is there's only two, so they have to kill each other. Yeah, but you would have to be trained by a Sith to become a Sith. Then I'll get trained by a Sith. You've got two choices. Darth Maul. So your point... There's more than two Sith anyway. Darth Maul's still alive. Your point... Darth Maul kind of doesn't count, though. He's a Sith. He was a Sith. No, no, now he's we, still now a he's Sith. A, now he's a robot who works with Sith abilities. You're right. Then that, by that logic, Darth Vader not a Sith, just so a robot. Once you're no, a Sith, no, because Darth Vader is is like the 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 pupil to the master. While Darth Maul once was that, and when he was cut in half, became not the the pupil. So he he's not a Sith anymore. But he's he just... still knows the ways of the Sith. So therefore, he's still a fucking Sith. Which no, he's. This is the guy with the pointy heads and the red oh, yeah. face. From the prequels. Yeah. The good bit from the so prequels. So you're saying, you're going to turn... What are you going to do once you're a Sith and you're the only Sith left? Kill you're going to rule the galaxy. So... Or, your whole I'm just going to live peacefully. So your whole premise around, like, destroying the Siths is to then be a Sith and then be the one Sith Lord. Mm-hmm. Yeah, or, that doesn't sound like you're killing all the Siths. Yeah, it doesn't seems like you've killed all the Seems like there's still one Sith there. Fine, I'll kill myself. No more Siths. You've fallen into my trap because you see, my friend, I don't care if I die. But you'll, you'll, no, you will. First then of all, you'll be like, hey, this feels real good. First like, of all, all Power. this is redundant because I hate space. Power. I think it's pretty, space is pretty terrifying. Space, yeah, space is terrifying. I don't want to go to space. I, would you, I think I'd, yeah, anyway, I'd back go to, to space. Star Wars. <laughs> I'd go to space if I was, if there was like a 
tourist thing and I could go to like the moon yeah, like for a the day. Moon? Like that book feed. No, I'd be Great terrified book. that something bad would happen and I'd die. Why would that terrify you? It seems like something bad could happen here. And you You're right, die. but there's no danger of me suffocating by walking out on the street without wearing a special suit. I guess. You know what's pretty crazy? The first suits that were made, this is off track. It's got to do with space. The first suits that were ever made were literally just like tin foil and a whole like mm. some fabric and stuff. I saw one. It's it's pretty bad. <laughs> like it's pretty terrifying. Did it work? Well, yeah. Still more high tech Sweet. than the Star Wars suits, which are all just cloth. Yeah, but they don't use those in the vacuum of space. I'm very excited for Rogue One. Um, oh, don't get me wrong. I like Star Wars now. I you like everything like after. Star Wars before. Yeah, I just don't like anything before Episode Seven. Oh. Like I'm gonna go see uh, Rogue One. That looks awesome. Mm. I just don't like Star Wars before Episode Seven because I respect it because I, it's a great trilogy. It's a it's beautifully made and all that. I just don't like it. I only watched the like the actual all all the movies only like three years ago. Did you watch them in ago. order or did you watch them in the correct order? Oh, I don't remember. Did you watch uh, the original trilogy first or the prequels? I think I watched the one where where Phoenix and Will would be disappointed in me. Oh, the prequels. Yeah, I'm not disappointed in anyone. You're right. <laughs> Will's disappointed. Well, actually, Will doesn't care. The one where nerdy people would be like, how dare you the insult my culture. With Darth Maul. So, gonna, yes. gonna, gonna put it out there, a bit of controversy here. I like two of the three prequels. Oh yeah, your favourite is, um... I, I, my favourite is number six. Yeah. But I like one and two. Okay. Right? This means nothing to me. No. New Hope. That's number four. Oh, <laughs> damn it. Number one is the Phantom Menace. Oh, and you want to know why else I hate Star Wars? Why? Because fucking fanboys are always going like, oh, George Lucas is a genius. He planned it all out from the beginning. No, he didn't. He's an idiot. Yeah. The man was. The man had one film made. He was going to call it Star Wars, and that's it. Mm. And then, ever since then, he's been trying to fucking work it around it so people will be like, oh, he planned it out like this from the beginning. He didn't know this shit was going to happen. No one can call him a genius. He made Jar Jar Binks. Yeah. Rude. Jar Jar, Jar, Jar Binks a fucking is idiot. Delightful. Oh, you liar. You're lying. He's are so happy to see You're you, Gabby. You're lying through your teeth. Oh, my God. <laughs> He's so muy, muy happy to see you. When I was really young, I um like was channel surfing. And Star Wars came on. It was like the first time I had ever really seen Star Wars. And it was the episode, it was like the scene with Jar Jar Binks. And I was like, this is fucking shit. I was like, why does everyone like Star Wars? This is awful. Uh, I, I, I don't yeah. mind Jar Jar. P- apparently, if you watch The Clone Wars, he is the worst thing ever. But I liked mm-hmm. him in the first one. Except he does. Apparently, if you Me watch can. the films in general, he's the worst thing ever. Yeah. He, he, cry- he, he destroys the Republic. Just straight up. He what, does how does that. he do it again? Um, he's an idiot. He has the de- he uses the deciding vote to put the Siths in power. Yeah. Ba- well, basically... Um, in all that political bullshit storyline that everyone hates. Yeah. Basically, yeah. the politics of it all is uh, Padme, like Queen Amidala, mm. was all like, oh, I trust Jar Jar. Jar Jar, you can be my, my like, um, you can put in my vote instead of instead of everyone, like, instead of someone else. because That'd I be like if I let Phoenix have the oh, deciding and Jar Jar vote. And Jar-, up. and Jar Jar was like, oh, I, forgot I would this. like to give power to the Emperor, like, like to, to Senator Palpatine. He seems like top bloke. Idiot. And Senator Palpatine was like, yeah, guess what? I'm super evil. What? Order 66. No, oh. that was not Jar Jar's fault. That's fucking Padme's fault. But well, then yeah, Jar Jar but was smart enough right, to do is. it. You're right, it is. Padme's dumb. It's fault, but it was... He's clearly a bad guy. Who, Jar Jar? Emperor Palpatine oh, is my... clearly a bad guy. So the obvious. fact that Jar Jar didn't see that makes him just as bad. Dumb. Dumb. True. Dumb, dumb, dumb. It's uh... like every time he has a conversation with Anakin, it's like, by the way, Anakin, did I say I was a bad guy? I am, and Anakin's like, you're the best guy ever, you know that, Palpatine? Hey, Anakin, kill these kids. Uh, I'm starting to think that maybe this Palpatine guy is not so great. (laughs) No, no, he's he's right. Kids are terrible. Hack and slash. I I was a kid once, and I know that people didn't like me, so it's fair if I kill everyone else, right? (laughs) Yeah, he did have a honor, he's still... He always had the little the what? Rat rat's tail. tail. Rat's yeah, tail. the Jedi rat's tail. Yeah, oh. it, it, it's you get rid of it when you become a master. Oh, good to know. Right. See, then I don't want to be a Jedi. Yeah. There's See. no dress code for the Sith. <laughs> no black. Yeah. Oh no, I have to. Gee, whatever will I do with all of my wardrobe? <laughs> um, 
Let's talk about the quality of sand for a second. I would never want to date someone who thought sand, like, he's coarse like, and rough and he irritating. He despised sand so everywhere. much that he had to explain it before, like. Okay, so we know that you'll never date Will. <laughs> yeah. Because Will hates sand. Will hates sand. Will is Anakin, then. No. Well, well, Will thinks that's one of the best lines in the movie. It's no, what? Yah, because Will, he, because so Will identifies with it. Will is I just, wonder if he's ever going to listen to this. you're terrible at movies. We had a huge argument with Will and Gemma, me and Kyle, about how we did not These like are people that wrestling. don't exist because they've not been on the show. I yes. know, but we, we, how, um... You and some mates had an argument. With Will, who has been on the show. Yeah. Yes, how Will, uh, on Jurassic World, because Will thinks... Anything that is like remotely entertaining, entertaining is amazing. Just True. like that one line. Oh my god, Will, what is wrong with you, Will? He ain't so, gonna listen to this. He might. No, he so won't. I disagree with. He doesn't him. listen to the show. Well, I like because I hate Will. <laughs> to, 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 to quote <laughs> Dory, I like sand. It's squishy. Yeah, <laughs> it's squishy. It is squishy for her. That is right. Anyway, <laughs> Star Wars. <laughs> right. So, um, I like, I like how all the Star Wars is start basically the same. It's all just the one family's bullshit. Well, I was going to say, like, um, do 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 Oh, with the scroll. The scroll, and then it cuts into, it's actually in space and a ship coming past. Yeah. yeah. I, li- I like that. I thought that was, that's a cool Yeah, but thing I think it's annoying how in this galaxy full of stories, the only stories we ever seem to fucking hear about are about the Skywalker family being cunts. Well, not in, uh, not in Rogue One. You're right, which is why I think Rogue One's going to be awesome. I'm excited for Rogue One. Especially because it has Mads. Mmm, Mads Mikkelsen. Yeah. He is great. He's really I don't know good. who he is. He's you know great. Hannibal from Had- the TV Had- show Hannibal? Oh, yeah. Hannibal, Hannibal. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's, the he's bad the dad. guy in Doctor Strange. Yeah, he's, he's the yeah. dad. Mm. Yeah. I've, I've, okay, he, so you're in the... Okay. do anything for me. It's like, if he's in it, sure, I didn't... He's so good. He's a good actor. Yeah, I bet. He's be a male model, I'm pretty sure. That's cool. <laughs> male model. Right, so, <laughs> anyway. we're in the Star Wars universe. Yes. Yeah. The three of us. Yes. Sweet. A portal opens, we get sucked in. Yes, I'm Wait. leaving you guys Sweet. immediately. <laughs> what planet are we on, first of all? Uh, Tatooine. I was going to say Tatooine. Okay, Tatooine. We're it's on Tatooine. Desert. Yeah. Mad Max in it, straight we're away. On, we'll, we'll say we're in Mos Eisley, just because civilization. Okay. okay. we got to make a living. What are we doing? Uh, racing. I'm testing Pod racing? That. Pod racing. Are you going to go pod racing? No. Pod racing's illegal. I think I'll go... Straight so? up illegal. So? Doesn't stop him. That's true. Mm. I'm going to be a bounty hunter. Yeah, I might be a bounty hunter. We'll be bounty hunters. I'm gonna, I'm gonna find out how many midi chlorians I have, how high my midi chlorian <laughs> count is. Oh my god! Oh yeah, the I best forgot thing about George that. Made. <laughs> I'm gonna find out how high my midi chlorian count is and see if I can become a Jedi really, really late. Well, we're just gonna be bounty hunters because fuck it, it's too late for us. I could be a Sith. I'll be a little. I'll, ch- I'll, I'll dabble in the Jedi. I'll do a little bit You want to dabble, dabble in the Force. I want to dabble in the take Force. Take a little dip in the Force. I just want to put my little toes in. I just want to take a tiny little... I don't even want to open that fucking can of dog shit. I'm just going to bounty hunt. You're just going to bounty hunt. Yeah. That sounds good. Simple. <laughs> the trickiest bit will be getting a ship. Yeah. Not too tricky. Just steal it. You're, You're right. You're in Mos Eisley, right? You're right. I am in Mos Eisley. It's Mos Eisley, uh... It's where the cantina is. Where, who's the big worm guy? Jabba. Jabba. Jabba, Jabba the Hutt. Tatooine. Yeah. Kind of want to be as far away. You know, oh, possible. geez. We get a ship, we hightail it. <laughs> Tatooine <laughs> brings something up. Sand people don't make sense. They, Why not? They don't make sense. Okay, so... <laughs> I think I know where you're going I with this. I know what I would do in Star Wars. Sorry, keep going. <laughs> So I think sand, I know where he's going with this, but I so want to hear. So the sand people have to be the native people of Tatooine, right? I mean, I guess. Right, like presumably they're either the native people or they were brought there. They're native to Tatooine. Yeah. Yeah. What's your right. Point? So, so I'm just going to go through history. Yeah. Right? Okay. You, you've not actually. And, and, and you've not to, actually made a point no, yet, I'm which is to pissing it. me I'm off. I'm getting to it. I'm building up to it. It's it's going to be a climax, if you will. There's going to be a crescendo. Oh god. Um, so, so the way history works yeah. in almost all all matters of it is advanced people turn up. Yeah. They see the people that aren't advanced and they wipe them out. And if they don't wipe them out, they bring them into their 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 society and they change them. But sand people don't have that. 
Sand people are just like savages who kill things and no one's like, you know, we've got these savages here, we're not going to try to bring them into our society or kill them, we're just going to be let them be a pest to anyone who wants to ride a bike. Yeah, but to be fair, <laughs> no one appears to have tried to colonise Tatooine all that well. I guess. It's pretty, like, there's a lot of people on Tatooine, though. There's the like moisture people, farm. For a desert planet. There's the moisture farm and there's Mos Eisley. Right, but Mos Eisley Oh, and then there's cool. Jabba's Palace. There is Jabba's Palace. That's about it. Yeah, in that like little section, but you've got to like remember it's like a really big place. Obi Wan, Obi Wan lived further away from from like all of that as oh, well. Oh, sorry, yeah, you're right. And there's also like, Obi Wan in a cave. Like people live all around the joints. You've got the the just the, chilling in a cave. You've got the Jawas, right? And the Jawas seem like also native people, but they figured out that it's easier to not be like murderers. And just sell junk. Well, maybe uh, Tatooine was not colonized until after people have been like, oh, wait, no, appropriation is bad. <laughs> I don't know. When appropriation is stopping people from killing just random. Assimilation. Did it occur to you that maybe the same people aren't intelligent in any way? Uh, I think they're fairly They're animals. They're humanoid. They're animals, though, Phoenix. Mm. Anyway. But they build guns. No, they don't. They have sticks. They shoot. In, in yeah, they've got little they, shoot. They shoot. Got little pistol things. Yeah. Do they? Yeah. Yep. I reckon they stole those. Yeah, <laughs> okay. probably, but... They're not intelligent enough to be like, oh, I, I can have a conversation. The they just that... make that noise, like... They <laughs> obviously <laughs> communicate with each other. Yeah. Maybe. You're just sounding real, real xenophobic. The point being <laughs> is that... They don't people... have a real language. That's because they're not the humans. <laughs> Racist. Racist. Oh, I'm sorry. Racist. I uh, yes, because I'm the one that wanted white appropriation of a alien planet. Okay, yeah, I don't want it. I'm just saying that's I'm naturally saying what would, would happen. Sorry, that's the natural order of things, isn't it? You fucking that, racist. That, that's a historically Aye. how Aye, things would happen. Heated. You're oh a racist. I'm, I'm beginning to second guess my relationship with both of you. <laughs> I'm uh, just saying that. Fine, I'm going to Hoth. <laughs> historically, that's how things happen. There's a native and people. Yeah. Either assimilate them or wipe them out. It is true. Like, if aliens came to Earth, we'd be fucked. There are people in Star Wars with American accents. Yeah, and British accents. And, Br and Irish. Yeah. Does that mean there's a space Ireland? I think... Space I've, Ireland! I've heard this before from Deja Vu. Anyway... I, I think that... Okay, I'm sure someone's brought up the topic space before. Space Ireland. Yeah. Space Ireland. I think that it's just like 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 it is here. You know, you have accents for all different parts of the the world. You know, you would have different accents all part like throughout the the galaxy. Yeah, maybe. What's what's to say that the accents just aren't just similar to what we have? No, already. maybe there's an alien language that sounds really like an Irish accent. So then when you're you're around those people a lot, you like pick up a weird <laughs> Irish accent. So there's <laughs> an alien planet that speaks whoa, whoa, Celtic. I'm sorry, yeah. you, you're saying that. Irish accents are weird. Who's the racist now, Gabby? It's Phoenix, it's still us. It's Damn still it. you guys. Anyway, so what I want to do, this is what I would do. I would get a ship, get off Tatooine, go to the Ewoks, and go and the live with... Forest Moon of Endor. Yeah, and I'd go live with the Ewoks. And be Why wouldn't they eat you? Because they're Ewoks. Ewoks are vegetarians. No, but no, they're not. Then she just, yeah, she's, you're right. The only not. reason. But if she just wraps herself in tinfoil, she's solved your problem. Yes, that's they true. They don't like tinfoil. No, no they don't they, like shiny, they think shiny things are weird. Because well, they hail C3PO as a god. Yeah, C3PO oh, as yeah, a god. Oh, yeah, yeah, they do. Why would they eat me? They don't eat Leia. No, they don't they eat, try. They don't eat no, they don't eat Leia. They try to eat uh, Luke and Han Solo. Yeah, they, they do. do. They might see you and be like, oh, it's a woman. I'm not going to eat a woman. Yeah, they don't eat Leia, so, you know. Although we don't know if they were going to eat, they were not intending to yeah, eat Yeah, what Leia. happened after that party? You're right. Could have been a huge cannibal party. <laughs> <laughs> My little sister is trying terribly to sneak. No, now she's right stomping. That's great. Well, fuck, I want a fucking drink, alright? <laughs> fuck, fuck, You could have just said... Uh, whatever. Anyway. Yes. So, Star Wars, you're going to go to I Endor? I will rule the Ewoks. You want to rule the Ewoks? Actual democratic... Me and Phoenix have stuff about this. Actual democratic society. I, I didn't hear that. that you whispered there because you whispered it so the mic <laughs> couldn't pick it up. Ewoks would understand democracy. No. No. No, because Ewoks don't have democracy. No, because they would, because they'd all just do, like, what all everyone else is doing. How okay. did they go and fight, like, the Sith? They they didn't fight the Sith, they fought stormtroopers. Yeah. yeah. 
They just threw rocks at them. They did yeah, but why did they decide? Why did they decide? Because C-3PO spoke Ewok. Yeah, and C-3PO was revered as a god. Uh, and he asked them, hey, right. can you help out my bros here? And they were all like, oh, we guess, because you're god. Well, I guess I want to go there, man. Yeah, you can go there if you want. No, you guys are pretty much making it terrible idea I'd to go, go there. I go to the Death Star. Any, any, what? The Death Star's been destroyed. Yeah. Which one? Ooh. Or, so oh. we're going like right now where it would be. In yeah, the, okay. where they are in continuity now. So was after that planet episode... destroyed? The planet Death Star, or was yeah. it just its Death Star? Destroyed? Yeah, it was destroyed. Damn it! The whole planet is gone. Damn it! The whole planet was about a giant spaceship. It's gone now. Is Naboo gone? I feel like they destroyed Naboo in that in that movie, but it wasn't actually said it was. It Naboo. wasn't Naboo because isn't Naboo already destroyed? No, you're Which thinking of Naboo? Alderaan. Okay, Which Naboo one's... is the one from the prequels where like the that's Gungans Coruscant. Are. Is it Coruscant? Oh the planet no, there's the prequels? too many planets. There are a lot of planets, but uh... let's make our own planet. <laughs> yeah, with blackjack and, and hookers. hookers. In fact, you know, I forget the whole thing. Um. I went to the uh, Star Wars Generations exhibition in Germany. Speak louder. I went to the Star Wars exhibition of Star Wars Generations, I think it was. Okay. Or Star Wars, have you heard of this? No. Oh. Is it the thing you Snapchatted me? Yeah, I Snapchatted the whole thing. Well, that's yeah. good for an audio medium. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was Snapchatted multiple pictures of uh, Star Wars stuff, and you were an alien at one point. I was an alien, and it was in a, it was basically Star Wars just trying to money grab. Oh, I'd go to, to Kashyyyk. What's Kashyyyk? That's where all the, the Wookiees are. Just oh, hang okay. out with the Wookiees. Aren't the Wookiees yeah, all dead? Pretty cool. what? No. A lot like of a them Doctor are Who dead. Thing. He's the only one left. The last Wookiee. The last a lot Wookie. of them died during Order 66, but oh, okay. not all of them. Wait, does that mean all the Wookiees were Jedis? No. That would be so funny. The, the Wookiees were working with the Jedis because oh. they had a connection with Yoda. Oh, uh, yeah. Dagobah. Did... We're going to Dagobah now. You want to live in a swamp? Yeah. I'll be yeah, I'll live in a swamp. Oh, swamp no one all. else lives there, though. Yoda. Oh, wait, no, I'll go with him. Me and Phoenix will live in a swamp. Yeah. Oh, my God, you get so sick of each other. I yeah. don't know, we'll just record podcasts. And no one will get them. <laughs> we'll put them out into space. <laughs> oh, no. That sounds terrible. Space radio. Does Star Wars have radio? Hmm. How does radio work? Yeah, no, because... Uh, <laughs> radio would they work. Have, they have radios as in, like, communication. Yeah. What's Star Wars TV like? Bad. I I'd assume good. it's bad. Is there a Hollywood planet? I don't know what their fast foods are. I don't think it'd be a planet. Oh, yeah! Their Star fast Wars. Food. Fast food in Star Wars. Yeah, like Fifth Element McDonald's. <laughs> yes. That was so good. Do you know... Uh, anyway. <laughs> why would anyone... Sidetrack. Why would anyone buy a death stick? What's a death stick again? It's in It's in the second movie. Yeah, but what is uh, it? I, th- I think it's a cigarette, but I don't know because it's got the actual name Death Stick. So it's just a cigarette. Probably, except it's more like hardcore drugs, I think. So it's but, just meth in a cigarette. Oh my Probably. god, is that like I just like don't a... know why anyone, if you're going to name something like a drug, why would you put the word death in it? Because that immediately <laughs> evokes to me, oh, so I'll die if I take this. Yeah. You don't want to Call it crocodile. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> that sounds like a great drug to take. <laughs> That would be like imagine like a like a gritty a gritty Star Wars, but it was about the drug scene. <laughs> the drug scene in, I in want, Star Wars. I, I really want like a gritty Star Wars film about Obi Wan's time on Tatooine before he um, had to train Luke. Mm. So just him hanging out on Tatooine, and be like, I've got to wait for Luke to be an adult. Oh my god, just, that would be it would be like reality like TV. A crime, no, just like a crime movie about Obi Wan taking on the Huts. <laughs> nice. Also, I can answer your question about Coruscant and stuff. Okay. Coruscant is the city planet, and Naboo is the planet uh, Padme was born on. Oh, okay. I hate Padme. But she's cute. No, she's not. Padme's cute because she's Natalie she's Portman. Natalie Portman, I think. Natalie Portman. Portman's not cute. I think Natalie Portman's Shut cute. Shut your mouth. No. No? No! It's my show! No. Say what I want! Don't be an elitist just because it's your show. <laughs> We're still there. Technically, it's opinions. me and Phoenix's show. Hey there. <laughs> I think Natalie Portman's Dictator cute. Dictatorship. There you go. What? Yeah. Phoenix is allowed hosts, to think what he wants, but I disagree. One of the hosts said Natalie Portman was cute. Um, he's wrong, but he's allowed to think that. Natalie Portman's a babe. Especially she's good she looking, but I don't think hair. she's cute. Mm. Yeah, it's really good. Anyway. Which member of the Skywalker family is the best looking? Oh, um... I think it's uh, Ben, Sol- uh, ben Solo. I think it's... It, uh, Wait, Solo family or... Yeah, technically, he is. Uh, yeah. Kylo Ren is the son of a Skywalker. I'm gonna say Ray because he's Leia's kid. Yeah. 
Ray's not a Skywalker. I disagree. Ray is, uh, yeah, yeah. Is she? Yeah, I think she's she totally is. What evidence Luke's. have you got? Uh, I've got the Luke's evidence of. Sure. You got, what evidence have you got though? Because she gets stranded on on. That's Tatooine. not evidence. That's a thing that happened. She gets stranded on Tatooine. It wasn't Tatooine. Oh, it's just get... another desert planet. She gets stranded on another desert planet around the same time that Luke leaves. Everyone like every time all the family saw her, they got oh, acted really sus because they're like, oh shit. Oops. They just because they've never met this woman before. I just think That's that I just, if I showed up at your house with just some random girl, would you not be a bit weirded out? Okay, well they hadn't seen the black guy before, but they didn't act weird around him. Finn. They did actually. They didn't act that weird. Finn, that's his name. The thing Finn. is that I I don't have any evidence. It's just a feeling I have. I think she's uh, Obi Wan's kid. See, I've heard that, and to me, it doesn't make sense. No, Why not? There's too much it's... sexual tension between. <laughs> no I just feel like the time difference. I'm sorry. Is... Hang on. So if there's more sexual tension between Kylo Ren and Rey, then they have to be related. No, no they look, can't be brother and sister. That's what I'm saying. Look, I'm but not realize, saying they're brother and sister. I think they're cousin. They're but cousins. the reason I don't think it's Obi Wan is because, like, like so, what's it called? Force Awakens is set like a good while after Star Wars Six. Yeah, right. But she's still fairly young. She, she, to me, too young. She's like in her thirties, mate. Is she? I thought Ray. she was like mid twenties. Oh no, wait, no, you're no, right. She she's is, not she's in, her in like 30s. early twenties. Yeah, early twenties. And to me, the timelines don't ma- uh, match up with Obi Wan Kenobi uh, dying in Episode Four. Having a kid already and it becoming Ray when she's older, the, it mm. just it feels like you're. It'd only be like maybe a few years off, but still, I think it's enough time for it just not to line up well. Yes, because as we know in Star Wars, ages and timelines always make sense. Well, we'll we'll see. You know, the movie's coming out next year, but you know that's just how I feel. I feel Whatever. like it's probably Luke. <laughs> uh, I still think. And if it's that... not Luke, it's the the chick with the glasses. Oh, the alien. Yeah, that one. You think the alien yeah. is you Ray's think mother? That, yeah. Maz is um, Ray's mum. <laughs> yeah. Hundred percent. You're wrong, but whatever. <laughs> I think you're a little, a little you're off. You're not even, a, not even close. Not even it was the same Ma- It was Maz and Yoda, but that's still not the answering my question. What if it's she's Yoda's child? And Again, you, like, what color was the what color was the lightsaber? It was blue because it wasn't her lightsaber. Because it wasn't her lightsaber. Yeah, yeah. She borrowed it. It was Luke's. It was, it was and Yoda's lightsaber was green. Yeah. yeah. And what color was Luke's? Blue. Exactly. Because she's she Luke's borrowed child. it. She's Luke's child. She's Luke's child. It's not her lightsaber, though. She's Luke's child. Oh, my fucking God. We're not having... <laughs> Illuminati confirmed. She's Luke's child. I'm going <laughs> to... When you guys leave, I'm just going to stab myself. <laughs> okay. All right, you do that. You have fun. Have a great day. Shut up. <laughs> just shut up and get the fuck out of my house. All right. Just, That's just lovely. Such a good Just don't, just good don't get blood on the computer, because it'll, it'll jank it all up, and you yeah. won't be able to edit. If I die, I'm not putting this out. <laughs> Damn you it. Could, like, then I'll have to do it. You could give the, the no, computer you to your no. sister. No. Just don't. Just put a put a mat down before you do it. You don't want to make your mum have to clean up the mess. <laughs> so Star Wars. <laughs> Has anyone seen Clone Wars? Because I've only seen one episode of Clone Wars in a terrible movie. Um, no, I haven't seen. Clone I've not Wars. seen Clone Wars. No. So the movie is about uh, Anakin Skywalker and um, what's the girl's name? Uh, his apprentice. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Um. Fuck, I don't remember. But it's, I know who you mean. Really yeah, yeah. cool. Yeah, it's the two of them babysitting Jabba the Hutt's child. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's so dumb. That's the entire movie. Is... Did they did they have no choice or were they just like? It's like Jabba the Hutt is paying the Jedi Order a certain amount of money to to look after his child or retrieve his child from so and so, and so they're like, okay, we'll do it. And then it's just them with a baby Jabba the Hutt. Wow, like a baby. Worm. You know what's funny? I've it not seen bad. the Clone Wars movie. I've seen Caravan of Courage. Oh no. What is Caravan of Courage? Uh, the Star bad. Wars Christmas it's, special. It's bad. Oh, Wait, no, not, not Carrot yeah, and Courage. Not, the Star Wars would, Christmas why special. Would, yeah. Why would space have a s- Christmas? They don't. That's the plot. The Star Wars Christmas special uh, is about uh, Chewbacca's family. Mm. And it's like a really bad episode of a sitcom. Oh, no. And there's lots of like celebrity cameos. And they're traveling back to see... This che- is a cartoon, right? No. no. <gasps> what? This no, is all live action. action. Oh, my God. How have I not seen this? How old is it? It's straight guy. Really old. It never got released on oh like my home god. media. It's on YouTube. It's fucking awful. Oh my god, that sounds amazing. There's bits that really are animated, mode. but the animation is ugly. Mm. It's just yeah, it's a time. It was released on VHS. Was it? I think so. Like oh, when yeah. it first came out, and no one bought it, so they got rid of it. 
I don't blame them. It's terrible. Yeah. But anyway. How was Star Wars. <laughs> Star Wars. Star Wars. But yeah, so they, so like, um, basically I watched the Clone Wars movie before I watched any of the show. Yeah. And I watched the movie and I was like, this is stupid. <laughs> why, why would anyone want to watch the Clone Wars? And then I watched an episode and I'm like, this is alright. One day I'll get to it. So. And then I never did. <sighs> With, do you know heaps about the Clone Wars and stuff? I know a little bit. So. Talk louder. Does I know Luke, a little bit. Does Luke, Lucas? George. Sorry, George Luke. Lucas. Lucas. Lucas, as in Lucas Skywalker? <laughs> Is that guy Lucas? Lucas George. No, George Lucas. Um, George, yeah, what about George? Did he, did he like, help with... No, not really. ...what happened in... So they just kind of went they off on their own. They just went on their own thing. Oh. But it's about... It's it's basically... A lot of people complain about the third movie, uh, which is my least favourite Star Wars movie. Yeah. People complain, and I share this complaint, that Anakin goes from good guy to really evil guy in two seconds. There's no build up to it. It's just like, I'm a good guy. Oh, Palpatine's bad. I'll I'm join him. I'm a bad guy. I'm really bad now. I'm a slaughter from, children. From my, my point of view, the Jedi are evil. It's like, why? Nothing happened that would make you think that, except Mace Windu didn't. Like, Mace Windu was like... You can be a, you can be on the council, but you're not a master. And he's like, that's not fair. <laughs> His and name then, is Mace Windu, and he got thrown out a window. Yeah, and then Mace Windu wow. is like, that's bit, that's that's sad. Mace Windu it's is funny. all like, hey, apparently uh, you, you said Palpatine's evil, right? And he's like, yeah. And he's like, no, if if it's true, we might make you a master. And then all of a sudden he's like, so I'm on the other side now because I can be a master immediately. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, but the Clone Wars apparently does a lot more to build up the transition from a good guy to a bad guy. So do the uh, the new comic books I've got coming out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. From Marvel. Which they is good books? because... Yeah. They've always had comic books. They've, you, they used to get printed, I think, by Image Comics. Yeah. But since Disney were all like, no, no, if you're going to put out comic books, you should put out comic books on the comic book company that we own. Mm. So Marvel print them now. And apparently they're very good. Yeah. You know who would be awesome to have around... Like B B little cutie. BB8. BB8. I don't BB-8. like BB8 that much. I love BB8. I love BB8. He's tiny and adorable. BB8. And BB8 is R2D2. BB8's yeah. the lame man's R2D2. BB8's a. Yes. Yes. Huh? I thought you liked BB8. I do, but he's also a child's R2D2. He's better than fucking C3PO. Hey. <laughs> Oh, he's God. the gayest fuck on the. <laughs> I think Did you we're in a. Him I think sex? we're in a spot. Oh my! <laughs> oh, oh! Oh dear! Oh dear! <laughs> I can't, but only because I can't imagine like eight year, nine year old Anakin building him with that in mind. There's an online. Oh pod. no! Yeah. Why did a... he make him a boy? Yep. He gave him a shame chip. Yeah. Fuck you, Luke. I mean, Anakin. Yeah. Yeah. Um. With all that done, I think we're done for this episode. Yeah, <laughs> probably done. Yeah. Uh, I've, I've been Ben. I've been Gabby. And I have been Phoenix. That was one <laughs> Kenobi. Okay, alright, cool. My name's Ben, I'm closer to being Obi-Wan yeah, than you. Really you. Coward! <laughs> Fool! I might... like to send the boys topics for the hat, contact us on Facebook or Twitter. Links are in the description.